Hello my friends and welcome to my organic chemistry video. In this video tutorial, I want to show you how to name this compound. First of all, you need to identify this. Does this unique name given to any compound or any molecule of this kind? Here you see OH attached to a benzene ring. Such kind of stuff has a name called phenol. Whenever you see this in organic chemistry, just know or identify this to be phenol. Does that make sense? Now, looking at this compound, you're already seeing it here alongside with this ring. Now, we have two substituents attached to this benzene ring. The first one is this nitro group. The second one is also a nitro group. So, we have two nitro groups at different positions on this molecule. So, the phenol is already taking the position one over here. Then this one is position two, of course, there are three, fourth carbon, five, and six. The position two and position four were the position where you could find this uh, nitro group. So to that effect, we just take care of this and also this to give us two comma four. Now pay attention, between numbers, you have a comma. Between number and later of the alphabet you have an hyphen that's very important to note so we have two four because of the positions we are these nitro groups if this one were to be somewhere here we should have maybe two five if this were to be here then we have two three so for us to have two numbers then it becomes di remember i said these are nitro group so di nitro and remember the first thing I started with. This molecule is what we call the phenol. Does that make sense? So the name becomes 2,4-dinitrophenol. That is the name of this compound. If you see the step-by-step -step process, I walked it through for you to be able to know how to name this compound. And I hope you found this video helpful. Please consider to hit the subscribe button, turn on the notification bell if you found this helpful.